Hello everybody, welcome to Shore Shot Archery, Anthony here and in this video I'm going to be giving you a tour of Arizona Cup. Right now you see a great view of the parking lot and the main entrance where some vehicles are pulling in. Uh, I'm filming this on official practice day which is also a qualification day for the seniors so my division is going to go shoot practice in the morning here and then uh, closer to around the afternoon we'll start scoring uh, for qualification because we'll have eliminations the next day. Um, very interesting. Oh, it's going to be a very busy day for me. Uh, information like that, like schedules and stuff, I'll have down in the description uh, down below. It'll be, you know, to the Arizona Cup site and USA Archery. Uh, for this video, I'm just going to give you a walkthrough of, you know, kind of what to expect. You know, things do change every year, but uh, this should give you a pretty good idea on what 2025 Arizona Cup is going to look like. Uh, so behind me, as I said, we have uh, the parking lot. We're going to go and hit up uh, the vendors area, check in. We're going to show you the, the first shooting field here. We're going to take a walk over that way and walk to the next shooting field. Uh, it's going to be quite the hike around this place, uh, but we got beautiful weather, nice blue skies with the sun out, and it's actually pretty mild uh, so far this morning. So uh, let's begin the tour and uh, show you what uh, Arizona Cup 2024 looks like. All right, so we got everything flipped back around. As I was saying earlier, you end up coming through this way, and then you got a lot of parking lot to choose from. I think I think they actually expanded it a little bit this year, uh, more so than last year. Could be wrong, but parking lot is getting bigger and bigger. It seems like every year. Uh, we got the vendor village over there. We'll walk through that in a moment, but let's turn around and take a look at uh, the first range itself. And each range is denoted by uh, USA Archery on their like site map and things. So, do you want all the official names for these ranges? I think they have like an east and a west range, if I'm not mistaken. I believe this is the west one, but I could be wrong. Uh, this video is going to be more for just a visual. You can get all the details from USA Archery and the Arizona Cup website. So, uh, the layout we got going on here. Uh, we have the free area where you set up your own tent. We have premium seating where you pay for seating but you're not an archer. And then we have archers uh, area where you know you have to be an active archer to be sitting in this area. Uh, they have little signage on the field. We'll zoom in a little bit there. You can see there's a waiting line, there's a media line, there's a shooting line, and then all the way out there is the three meter line. Uh, we got lines between each target, and uh, this field ends at target uh, 75. So 1 through 75 is on this field, and then it picks back up on the other field at target 77, and we'll see where it ends, uh, you know, <laughs> a little further through this video. Uh, so right now all of these archers are uh, practicing, because it is uh, official practice for uh, the senior divisions. Uh, there may or may not be some other divisions going on, but I think they're all senior, uh, Olympic recurve, and compound. I don't know if there's any barebow. It doesn't look like, eh, there might be one, a couple barebow. Um, but, yep, everybody's practicing. Uh, as we keep walking here, you can see the continuation of uh, premium seating, and it's, it's the same thing all the way through. Uh, there is a first aid tent here, and there will be somebody here uh, later on, especially when we get to official qualification and elimination days. Uh, the bathrooms of choice here are going to be porter potties. They got hand washing stations, so that's a very good thing. And uh, we'll, uh, we'll keep walking through here. Uh, in front of us, we got some archers waiting in line. This should be uh, registration. We'll take a look. They may have changed it, but they, they probably didn't. All right, look at that. Archer registration, A through M, N through Z. Look at all these archers waiting here. <laughs> uh, as I walk uh, this way, uh, that's where we just came from. We got DOS right here. We got uh, announcements being made, telling people to get their equipment inspected and to uh, go to registration. Uh, we got compound down here. A lot of uh, para compound archers. Really cool. Uh, this is this is going to be quite an event this weekend, which is it's going to be a lot of fun. Um, they do usually have a water exchange station, and I think that's a little bit further down. So let's let's keep on walking. 
Ah, yes. Here is the water exchange station. It looks like the local club's also selling uh, snacks and candy. So, there you go. And then the water exchange station, you just bring your water bottle and they give you a new one. And, uh, you know, it's probably for archers only. But, uh, you know, just so you know. Uh, all right, we're getting down to uh, more compounds. And there's uh, an equipment inspection uh, station all the way down there too. We'll head that way and check it out. Just to show you what's going on. I think it's the only... Uh, there might be an there might be an equipment inspection station on the other side of the field that I missed, but uh, this might be the only one. We'll find out. Uh, so down here, equipment inspection. You got to make sure your compound is not, uh, you know, too strong. You got to make sure your Olympic recurve meets all the requirements. You get to run into Stephen here. How you doing? Okay. All right. Um, and yeah, there you have it. So uh, let's turn back around. Now we're all the way at uh, the beginning of the field. We're gonna go and check out uh, the vendor area so you get an idea on, uh, on who's here. Of course we have AAE here because this is their, uh, their home territory. <laughs> um, but we'll see who else is here. I'm sure the Lancaster trailer is here as well. Let's see. Hey, it's your show. Yo, what's going on? All right, so back to the vendors. We got AAE here. They got a whole booth set up. You can check out all their stabilizers and sights and everything else. Pretty cool. Uh, as we keep walking through, you see this giant tent here. This is just a spot to hang out. You can eat food. Uh, it looks like there's probably going to be some other vendors here as well. They're just not here yet. Oh, we got Maven, optics, spotting scopes, and binoculars. Uh, as we keep going, we got oh, still some more empty booths. I might be a little early this morning, but uh, we got the archery path here as well. Hello. <laughs> Check them out. Uh, we got Gold Tip with their arrows and stabilizers, Bee Stinger stabilizers. And of course, we have uh, Lancaster. They got the full. Uh, trailer here with a ton of different accessories. They even got some short shot archery products here, and it's a uh, great uh, to you know, pick up knocks and things that you may need. Look, they even got a uh, short shot archery uh, windsock hanging in there. Pretty nice. Um, other than that, besides Jay, you know, doing his stretches, getting in the video. Behind him is uh, actually the podiums. Uh, if you take, you know, first, second, or third, which is pretty neat. And uh, with that, it pretty much wraps up uh, this section of the field until Natalie gets in our video. What's happening, Natalie? What's going on? Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah? 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 You tell us about yourself. How is life? Are you excited about the new training center in North Carolina? Very excited to get out there. We've been in California for the last three weeks, but very excited. Try to just work on some form this weekend, not really worrying about score. So, oh. happy to be here, shooting with my friends, seeing everyone I haven't seen in a year. So, there you go. All right, thank you, Natalie. Good luck, Natalie. <laughs> and uh, we'll keep on, uh, keep on going here. We got an impromptu interview. <laughs> um, we're gonna head to the uh, the other field now because uh, we've pretty much uh, you know, checked out everything that's going on here. All right, so our walk continues. Um, we'll probably speed up sections of this. Uh, there's a, another interesting part we're gonna get to in a, in a moment here though. Uh, the, uh, the finals area, where they're actually going to shoot the finals, is on the way to the second field. And you can probably already see it on uh, the left side of the screen there. Uh, looks like they're going a little more elaborate this year than other years. Um, they got a whole backdrop now, which is pretty cool. But uh, yeah, the finals will be here. They'll fill this up with, you know, the DOS and people announcing. They'll have, uh, you, know, uh, you know, stands for spectators to watch the archers. Uh, they got a whole backdrop. We'll check out the backdrop as we keep, uh, keep walking around. We'll see what that looks like. 
Uh, let's see, what else is going on here? Oh, I might be in the way of this uh, thing. There we go. You know, goal is to not get ran over, so that's, that's, a, that's a good goal. There's a road right here. We're going to take this path so we can show you the backdrop. Look, they got a little stage set up for the arches to stand on. They got some Arizona Cup finals banners, a nice big Arizona Cup logo. It should look pretty sharp. I think, I think it's going to look uh, quite professional. USA Archer will probably be live streaming this. You can, you can see all the archers shooting at the targets. Pretty, pretty sweet view. Look at that view. That might be the thumbnail there. <laughs> but uh, anyway, <clears throat> this road that is in front of us, uh, that is the direction you're going to come from. A little bit up there, you would turn down to go to uh, the range and parking we were just at. Or if you continue straight, um, you will go and make a right-hand turn right over here where it says, uh, well, it should say enter only. They have sign into the shear. Now there's some flags further down that say exit only. So you enter here and you exit over there. I think they're trying to keep the flow of this whole thing down a little bit better. Yep, enter only. Look at that. Um, let's see. Uh, to our uh, right over here is actually a uh, little public range. Uh, the one that the archers are shooting on today is also a public range, but they have... Uh, they have it set up differently for the public. But since we're here, uh, they got set up for, you know, USA archery style of archery. So, walking across the parking lot. Pretty light uh, vehicle-wise. This will be uh, fairly filled up. Uh, especially in another couple hours as everybody gets ready to uh, shoot. Um, this field is probably majority youth and masters divisions. Uh, I don't recall there being any senior divisions over here. I could be wrong, but um, you know, you're know you gonna have to check. It's gonna be a little bit different every year. Again, porter potties are the bathrooms of choice. We got a nice ramp, or you could walk up the gravel walkway. Let's see, they got a water station here. Um, the next one is um, check-in and uh, equipment inspection. Pretty cool. Nice little setup. Nice little hidden field. Um, it looks like we run from 76 all the way to 106, and uh, that's that's the whole that's the whole show. And same kind of setup. You know, you got your premium seating, you got your archer seating, and then you got your your shooting lines. Uh, pretty nice though. I think it works out. Uh, pretty good having this little extra field here. I actually practiced on this field uh, yesterday for unofficial practice while uh, the uh, senior uh, divisions, men and women's divisions, were shooting their uh, stage three of Olympic trials. So that was pretty cool. We still got to practice. They got to shoot their trials. And, uh, you know, it all, it all turned out pretty good. All right, so there you have it. That's a tour of Arizona Cup. 2024. Hopefully I can see you guys here next year in 2025. Uh, the event just keeps growing. Be interesting to see uh, you know, where it takes us uh, in the future as more and more archers come to these events to shoot and try to qualify for uh, the National Archery uh, team. So um, thank you again. Please check out the links to USA Archery and Arizona Cup's uh, website. And other than that, please like and subscribe. And as always, happy shooting.